Hey, Tom here from Tormach. And in this video, we're going to continue our cut test series and we're going to start working with some uh, grade 23 titanium. The idea today is not to push the machine as fast as it can go uh, because I've never, I've never got this stuff before. And so, um, again, we're going through just like we would do in the job shop and go, okay, well, let's start with some safe conservative feeds and speeds and see where we go from there. So we're going to do two different tools. We're going to use an eighth inch tool, uh, four flute and a five sixteenths four flute. It's the exact same two tools we used in the 304 stainless, uh, cutting series. Um, in fact, it is the exact tools. Like I haven't even changed the tooling yet, but let's just see uh, how it works. So eighth inch, four flute cutter, 250 surface feet. Just kind of a conservative setting, right? Just letting it go. So I'm just doing a 2D adaptive uh, cut. It's at a 10% step over right now. Nothing fancy. There we have it. Face, oh wow. That, um, I can visually, I can see the marks. Because, you know, it's a roughing pass, a tool pass. But, yeah. Looks great. Okay. The only thing that we've changed is now we're running a bigger tool. This one's got some wear on it already, but it should be all right. So, here we go. Exact same cut parameters. 10% step over. This time we're just using a 516th tool. So you can see everything else is the same. It's 250 surface feet, but because it's a larger cutter, we're at about 3,000 RPM. Our load's about 20% or so. Nothing terrible. Heck of a lot faster to do this cut with a slightly larger uh, tool, right? Titanium is not something you need to be afraid of. This is grade 23, which is basically grade five that handles things a little bit nicer. To recap, everything went well. We used that eighth inch and five sixteenths cutters, but both four flute cutters. Um, they are included in our steel kit series. Uh, we'll go ahead and put the part number up for you. Uh, it's the exact same tools that I used when I was cutting the three or four stainless demo. In fact, not just the same part numbers, but it's the same tools. I haven't swapped them out yet. So they've had some wear on them. They worked perfectly fine. Uh, 250 surface feet per minute, about 1.8, 1.9 uh, thou uh, per tooth. So uh, it came out to be about 30 inches a minute. Um, lots on the table could absolutely push more uh 10 percent width of cut we were doing adaptive roughing um, and a quarter inch depth of cut which for the eighth inch uh, tool is 2x for the 5 16 tool is just a little bit over 1x again could have gone easily to 3x on that but again we weren't putting any real load on the cutting tool at all worked fine this was just baseline can we do it and yeah, absolutely, no problems at all. We could push this a whole lot harder. Uh, that being said, what do you want to see next? Leave a comment down below and let me know. I've got some 416 stainless here. I've got some 4140, a cold rolled steel. Thought about ordering something like Ink Canal or something like that. You guys tell me, what do you want to do next? Thanks again for watching and I'll see you again real soon.